Many factors, diseases, injuries, infections, dietary or hormonal deficiencies, these can all cause the collection of symptoms known as dementia. Now the fundamental concept to understand is that all of these causes have something in common. They change your brain on a cellular level. The cells in your brain, your neurons, are altered so that they're no longer functioning normally. This is what results in the classic symptoms of forgetfulness and brain fog that most people are familiar with. Your brain is the master organ that oversees every step of your daily life. Now, different regions and networks of your brain are involved in specialized tasks. So for example, laying down new memories relies on a part of the brain called the hippocampus, while the frontal lobe of your brain is critical for decision making and attention. So depending on where the disruption in your brain occurs, this is why you get different symptoms. In the two most common types of dementia, Alzheimer's disease and vascular dementia, typically the hippocampus is affected first, and that explains the early memory problems. Eventually, neurodegeneration begins to occur in other parts of the brain, which leads to more serious problems with the other tasks of daily living. Vascular dementia is caused by strokes in the brain. Depending on how severely damaged the tissue around a blood vessel is and the location of that damage, symptoms can vary widely. Risk factors for vascular dementia include high blood pressure and smoking and diabetes and obesity, so it's critical to maintain your overall health to preserve your cognitive health. Currently, there is nothing you can do to outright prevent dementia. There are no vaccines or vitamins or drugs to stop its onset. However, there are things you can do to reduce your risk of dementia or catch it early. There's a significant genetic factor involved in Alzheimer's disease. So if your family has a history of dementia, you should remain especially vigilant and monitor your own cognitive health. Dementia is especially prevalent after the age of 65 when it's diagnosed in one out of six people. However, because symptoms only show up after several years of neuronal or brain cell degeneration, it helps to stay attentive and monitor your own cognitive health as well as the health of your aging loved ones. Overall, the best studied way to prevent or slow the onset of dementia is to stay active, both mentally and physically, every day.